Hi there, it's Roseanne here from Country Chic Paint. Although chalk-based paints are often associated with shabby chic distressed furniture, that doesn't necessarily suit everyone's style. That's why today I'm going to show you how to create a more modern looking furniture finish with Country Chic Paint. Stay tuned to find out more. Modern home decor is generally known for clean lines and smooth finishes. In this tutorial, I'll show you the steps to achieve this look and feel with Country Chic Paint products. To start, you'll want to use our Country Chic Paint Synthetic Bristle Paint Brushes when you paint your project. These brushes are all designed specifically to be used with our paint and they will create a professional looking finish with minimal brush strokes. Another great option is using our painting sponges, which are perfect for applying smooth, thin paint coats. I painted this little chair a few days ago with two thin coats of Bliss All-in-One paint to give it opaque coverage. As I mentioned, most modern style furniture has clean lines and an opaque finish, so I'm not going to distress this piece at all. Instead, I would like to create a buttery smooth finish to achieve this, I'm going to show you how to wet sand and seal your piece with hemp oil for a modern look. Hemp oil is a drying oil. This means that it polymerizes and hardens into a protective coating for your furniture. You can use it on raw wood, furniture pieces painted with country chic paint, on leather, or even on wooden floors. Best of all, it's 100% natural and contains no chemical additives at all, so it's very safe to use. When applying hemp oil over a painted piece, you want to make sure that you give your project at least a couple of hours to dry completely. I'm going to use this painting sponge to apply the hemp oil to my piece. It's easier to apply uh, sparingly than instead of using a brush. The hemp oil is quite dark green. Um, however, as you apply it on your project, you'll see it darkens the paint color, uh, but that will lighten as it oil dries. It does definitely not make your piece look green. When you're done applying the oil, you can rinse your sponge out with some warm water and a gentle soap. Now, to achieve the buttery smooth finish, I'm going to gently wet sand my piece with this 400 grit sandpaper. I'm folding it around a sanding block to make it easier to use. You want to make sure you keep your paper flat and you want to use a light hand. When you're happy with the smoothness, you can use a lint-free rag to buff away any excess oil. Then you can let it sit for 12 hours so the oil can fully penetrate into the finish. After you've let the first coat of oil dry for about 12 hours, you can uh, use a clean lint-free rag again to buff and remove any excess oil that might be left on the surface still. Depending on how much use your piece will get, you may want to add one or two more coats to add more protection. By using the ultra fine grit sandpaper in combination with the hemp oil, you can create a stunning modern look on any project piece. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a comment if you have any questions or click the like button. If you'd like to see our upcoming tutorials, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Visit our website countrychicpaint.com to find out more about our products and see where you can find them. Thank you so much for watching and happy painting.